first, Kevin Costner lights up the screen with his eclectic collection of characters, from Lieutenant Dunbar in Dances with Wolves to Ray Kinsella in Field of Dreams. And his boyish good looks continue to capture audiences, including on stage with his band Modern West. We caught up with the Academy Award-winning actor at the Country Thunder Music Festival in Florence, Arizona. We just came to play our brand of rock and roll. And by the way, thank you for going to the movies all these years. Well, we all have our favorite Kevin Costner movies, and now you can add your favorite playlist to the film star's resume. My wife actually uh, was was kind of started bugging me about playing music again live, and and uh, I told her, yeah, I didn't didn't really want to. I, you know, I, and and she found some of my old music and and John's old music, and we. She kept saying, I don't know why you don't play this because I think I really like it, and she goes, I think people would too, and I said. Yeah, yeah, I mean, kind of like a kid who didn't want to take out the garbage or mow the lawn. I just kept putting it off, and for three years, she said, I think you should play live wherever you're making a movie, because you love it that much. A lot of these songs you're going to hear tonight were uh, written during, uh, while some of the movies maybe you were making out to were, uh, were being made. So why don't, we, uh, why don't we just break the ice here and get right down to what's important in music, yeah? I listened to her and five years ago we started playing without any idea of where it would take us you know there was no plan there still really isn't a plan and we started playing little little things and it's kind of led across the ocean and it's led right back here to John's home turf and it's been an interesting ride for us John is John Coyneman, who was music supervisor for Kevin Costner's award-winning film, Dances with Wolves. So we met when we didn't have a couple of nickels to rub between us, you know, so and the only then things began to happen for me, and John and I met in, uh, through mutual friends, and we had an appreciation for each other and about what each of us did, and then we started to collaborate musically. The Modern West just returned home after a successful European tour. Well, we didn't know it was going to be like that. We didn't, you know, I mean, you know, People can put anything they want in retrospect, but we had no idea that, you know, to listen to songs that were purely story oriented, you know, um, very American for sure. And, you know, you put on an hour and a half concert and they don't they don't have one single song they can tap their foot to that, that at least they know. So we didn't know what to expect. But, you know, we went over there and we played really loud and we played long and people, you know, halfway through were leaving their seats and, you know, coming to the stage and. And by the end of the tour, people were not waiting. They were just at the front. And uh, it was successful for us. And, you know, whatever happens going forward, you know, I'm always going to have that moment, you know. No one can take that one away. Well, everyone in the band writes songs, making it a little tough to decide on what's going into a set. We perform our, our original stuff. I mean, we like playing songs of our friends, some of them famous, some of them probably should be, you know. Um, we'll do that you know, one or two songs and said tonight we'll probably we'll probably pay fourteen songs and we'll play one song of somebody that I like and the rest of it will be ours. He never pushes for his music in movies though. I try not to shove anything, you know, I try not to force anything in any medium uh, when it makes sense. I mean we put some songs in swing vote but it made sense. I leave uh, the great scoring to those who write great scores. Next stop for Kevin Costner in the Modern West? Well, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Yeah, Wisconsin. Stop it. I was kind of close. You should have said I was warm. I get that it's not the state. For the Country Thunder Festival in Twin Lakes this July. We've had really great receptions in Wisconsin for a, a lot of different reasons. Hopefully, people just enjoy what we do. And guaranteed, you'll enjoy what they do. You can check out more of Kevin Costner and Modern West. Just go to BetterTV.com and click on the Links tab.